what do you got? <gasps> what is that? <gasps> and socks? What is it? Did you get your soccer uniform? Yeah, look at that. And green socks? Yeah. Woohoo! So I just went and picked up Porter's a soccer uniform. It's the exact same as the one Grayson's been wearing this last two years. I wish they would have let me get just save money and use his old one, but they wouldn't. I had to buy a new one, even though I have two of this. I have two of these jerseys now. Now I have three and three pairs of green socks. But yes, I have Porter's uniform for soccer. He has his first game. It's really just practice at his age on Saturday at 8.30 a.m. It's going to be early. Um, and I'm so excited to see how he's going to do. Hopefully he does better than what Gray did at three years old because when Gray did his first season of soccer practice, I basically had to be out on the field the whole time with him. He would not stay out and focus. So I'm hoping Porter does better, but I'm keeping my expectations low. Are you so excited to play soccer? I turn a TV up. Oh, thank you. Are you so excited to play soccer? Yeah. Wow, that's going to be so fun. Are you going to kick the ball? You're going to score a goal? Yeah. yeah. So Grayson's soccer coach, he's had the same soccer coach Mama, all three years to... now. Porter, since he is a different age, he has a brand new coach. So we'll see if this coach is good or not. It's all volunteer coaches. So any coach that takes time to volunteer to. Oh, you want to wear it? Yeah, wear it. Oh, okay. Any coach that takes time to like volunteer, of course, like his kid is on the team, is probably a good person. So I'm excited to see how um, Saturday goes. We're out here playing in the front yard. Porter's kicking a basketball around. Some random guy gave us this basketball at the park the other day. Porter likes it. And Grayson's over here drawing with sidewalk chalk. Oh good, it works. First he draw a little city. So this is a house. This is Graham's house. And there's smoke and some bushes and windows and a door. And then there's a road. <clears throat> and then this is his little city and the highway. What house is this? Our house. Oh, that's our house. Okay. So yeah. That's how we get to Graham's house, I guess. And then he draws this person over here. <laughs> and I said, Grayson, who is this person? And he said, it's somebody with big eyes and she likes to put me in time out. Family time out when somebody does something bad. Oh, and what does that say? She puts, uh, she, puts them. she puts them in time out. And I said, who is that? And then he put name mommy. So apparently he drew me. And what's what am I holding? What is that? Your phone. Oh my phone. Like here. Yeah, because I'm holding my phone. I see. So yeah, that's this a lovely the, picture. This is the outside of your phone and this is the inside of your phone. Oh thank you. So we had a busy day today. The boys both had their first soccer games of the season. I will input some clips that I took this morning. <laughs> oh my god. He's like, why am I doing this?
Go on, bud. Order, go kick it, go kick it, kick it, go kick it in the goal, go, 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 kick it for it, go, 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 go for it, go, no, no hands, bud, kick it in the goal, oh. So close. Kick it in. This is Grayson's third year of soccer, and this is Porter's first year of soccer. So um, Grayson, his team is called the Earthquakes, and they are blue, and Porter is just the regular like little kids green team. And Porter did so good this morning. He tried to get the ball. He stayed out on the field the whole time. He scored multiple goals. It was really like him and another kid that were like the best on the team. I was so and impressed. I he tell me about loved my, it. And tell me about my soccer. Then Grayson had his soccer game and it was cool to see because now that he's in a level higher because of his age, they actually play like legit soccer games. So they have like quarters and halftime and they sub kids out. So he has a um, the teams are 10 kids each, but they only do six on six at a time. So they are, always have four kids on the bench. So that was really cool. Grayson was a starter. He didn't do the best, which he never does. He's always at the back of the pack. Not very aggressive, just kind of wants to cheer the team on. But it was fun watching him. <clears throat> so I hope you enjoyed those clips I took. But it was super fun. So every Saturday that every Saturday morning, that is where we will be at the soccer fields. Um, we actually have a week off um, next weekend because it's Labor Day and everybody's busy. So they don't schedule games on Labor Day. But then every weekend after that till Halloween, they have games. And Porter's games are always at 830 in the morning. Grayson's games change every week. Sometimes they're at 9, 10, 11 or noon. I think noon is the latest we ever have. So they will be busy. They do play on two different fields, which is kind of a bummer. The one Porter plays at, we'll have to drive to, and the one Grayson drives at, we will walk to. We had like a little bit of an hour break in between games. It really was fine. And then my sister, Allison came, my sister-in-law, Ellie came, and then my brother-in-law, Garrett, came to cheer on the kids. So that was really nice that they came. And yeah, it was fun. And then the rest of the day we had quiet time, nap time, and then we went to the store to get some things for the lawn. Um, we've been having like some kind of fungus on our lawn with brown patches. And then we've been having like moss in our soil and the joys of being a homeowner. So we got some stuff. And then the kids and I have just been out here playing um, in the last hour before bed. Anthony's inside with Avery. So I'll show we're you just my room. hanging out while Grayson draws and Porter runs around and pees on trees. 
so that's what we're doing and um football college football's back on so we've been having that just like in the background on the tv there's really no good games on the bearcats don't play till next week um and we can't even watch it next week because it's on like pack no it's on like espn plus so we don't have that kind of a bummer but it's all right <clears throat> but other than that we're just kind of chilling having a good weekend so i hope you guys are enjoying your last weekend of august can't believe summer is almost over. Um, I am itching to get out my fall decorations though. As soon as Labor Day hits, I'm decorating for fall, even though it's been like so hot. The heat index yesterday or two days ago was like 105 to 115, but I want to decorate for fall so bad. Judge me all you want, but I cannot wait. I'm not excited for like the cold and I'm not crazy about Christmas and all that, but fall is my favorite season and I cannot wait to decorate for it, so. Next weekend, maybe I'll make a vlog and decorate my house. <laughs>